Okay, let's do one more of those, okay? So like I said, we're building on the... Oh, forgot my center, didn't I? I'm so fired! <laughs> okay. Okay, so let's just get these guys in there. These are really quick flowers, and you know, not everybody can do gum paste. People don't want to take, you know, gum paste is a whole other set of skills, and uh, you know, they can't eat the flowers on a wedding cake, so make them buttercream, and you'll have everybody fighting over them. Literally. The kids Yummy. Especially, they like the, the buttercream flowers, so just kind of throw that in there, like that one, too. Okay, so. What's so you next? could have two la two layers or three layers. Yeah, it doesn't on, matter. On the sunflower. Sunflowers okay. can be. I mean, I've had some. The big mammoth ones would have you know one or two um, rows of petals, or the little the little guys, or you know they're not all the great big huge huge ones. So um, okay, let's do something a little bit different. Um, just as a gee whiz, I guess. This time I'm going to do two blobs. Oh, slow oh, down. Know, Hold on, slow down. Why well, I'm mixing it up. Oh my gosh. Mixing it two up. Two blobs? Two blobs. For the price of one? Yes. Okay. Can you believe it? I don't right. believe it. I'm paying attention. Okay. And then we're going to do again with our squeezy thing here with the little 233 tip. Okay. Now here we go. Now we're going to do squeezy here. Is this still the leaf tip? Still the leaf tip with that yellow icing in there. Okay, and then we're going to come over here, and we're going to fill this one, and we're going to come back. You had no idea what I was going to do, did you? No, not a clue. I'm still not exactly sure. Well, we are making two flowers at the same time. Like twins. Twins. See? Now there's two. So you don't, you know. Cool. So don't, you know, you can do two on one if you want just to get them so they're kind of intertwined so that when you do put them on the cake, they're not buttoning up against each other and breaking off the, um, breaking off your petals as you try to yeah. maneuver them around. So that's kind of a fun one. Neat. Look at that. Who knew? Okay. Who knew? I know. Who knew? Okay, let's do, what, oh, that's a lot of, wrong blob. Oh, well. It's, you know, if you do that, do yourself a favor and just take it off because what'll happen is it's too much buttercream and you'll end up, it'll slide off and you'll end up losing your flour. So just, you know, scrape it off and then just go back because it's, it, it's not, not worth, worth it. it. Huh? Okay. It's just not worth the hassle. Okay. Good so, to know. Sounds like it's from experience. Uh, yeah, ask me how <laughs> I know that. That's Linda's, Linda's thing always. Okay, so let's do, we have these purple here now. And we have some coral. Just going to do some more quickie little dudes here, and then we'll um, be ready to put them on the cake. So um, follow along if you like. What am I doing now? Purple, huh? Purple. I have purple. Okay, now we have purple, and this is uh, still a tip 103? Still a tip 103. A little wavy got going on got there. Got the wavy thing. Well, let's mix it up. Let's put. I really like the ivory, but let's do... What do you think? The coral with the purple? So, same basic thing. Still tip 103. Still tip 103. Actually, this is, yes, 103. I thought maybe it might be a smaller one, but it's not. Pretty colors. I like it. These are what we call fantasy flowers in the cake decorating world. Yeah. Because they don't really match anything, but, you know. Fantasy flowers. Fantasy flowers are our friend. Do a lot of fantasy flowers. Okay, so let me just do that one again real quick so that it's not just one all by itself on the cake. You'll find that the nail will kind of creep up your thumb and it's hard to keep turning it, so turn it back. Make it go back down. You don't have to, you know, and it, you know, keep everything close in. Don't, you know, but you'll notice as you're twisting it, sometimes it feels like it's getting away from you. Just you know, go back and bring it back around to the right position. See how I've got it and it's got it right to the knuckle and it just feels like I don't have, like it's not very secure, so that's all. 